हेलो फ्रेंड्स गुड मॉर्निंग आज का जो मेरा टॉपिक रहेगा वो प्रोडक्शन ऑफ एक्स रे जिसको मैंने दो पार्ट में डिवाइड किया है फर्स्ट पार्ट में फ्रेंड्स जो टॉपिक्स रहेगी वो डायग्नोस्टिक एक्स रे ट्यूब ग्लास एनक्लोजर कैथोड लाइन फोकस प्रिंसिपल एनोड एंड फोकसिंग कप फ्रेंड्स मेरी जो वीडियो रहेगी वो मोस्टली इंग्लिश में आ, लिखा हुआ है सारे नोट्स बट मैं इनको हिंदी में भी समझाता रहूँगा तो वीडियो शुरू करने से पहले आप मेरे चैनल को लाइक सब्सक्राइब कमेंट और शेयर जरूर करें और आ, मेरी जो वीडियो रहेगी वो आने वाले पैरामेडिकल रेडियोग्राफर के एग्जाम में बहुत ही हेल्पफुल रहेगी क्योंकि इसमें मैंने सारे सारे इम्पोर्टेंट और जिन जिन टॉपिक्स के ऊपर क्वेश्चन बनते हैं वही सारे नोट्स मैंने बनाए तो शुरू करते हैं फ्रेंड्स प्रोडक्शन ऑफ एक्सरे में फर्स्ट टॉपिक जो है वो डायग्नोस्टिक एक्सरे ट्यूब रहता है फ्रेंड तो डायग्नोस्टिक एक्सरे ट्यूब्स एक्सरेज आर प्रोड्यूस बाय एनर्जी कन्वर्जेशन व्हेन अ फास्ट मूविंग स्ट्रीम ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन इज सडनली डिसलेटेड इन द टारगेट एनोड ऑफ द एक्सरे ट्यूब बहुत ईजी है फास्ट मूविंग इलेक्ट्रॉन्स जब एनोड के ऊपर हाई स्पीड से सडनली हाई स्पीड से टकराते हैं तो एनर्जी कन्वर्सेशन के थ्रू एक्सरे प्रोड्यूस होता है बहुत ही ईजी है इसके बाद एक्सरे ट्यूब इज मेड अप ऑफ वायरस ग्लास दैट एनक्लोज वैक्यूम कंटेनिंग टू इलेक्ट्रॉन जो एक्सरे ट्यूब रहता है जिसका जो मोस्टली वो पायरस ग्लास का बना रहता है और इस ग्लास में वैक्यूम रहा जाता है जैसे कि दोनों डायग्राम दे रखे हैं दिस इज द पाइरेक्स ग्लास एक्सरे ट्यूब जिसमें कैथोड और एक तरफ एनोड दोनों रहे फिलामेंट नेगेटिव टर्मिनल कैथोड इलेक्ट्रॉन प्रोड्यूस कर रहा है और इधर एनोड जो कि पॉजिटिव टर्मिनल है जो एक्सरे जहाँ से प्रोड्यूस होता है कंप्लीट इजी वे में This is cathode and this is anode. Next, the electron are designed so that electrons produced at the cathode, cathode is negative electron or filament, can be accelerated by high potential difference toward the anode. Positive target electrons. से मैंने बताया है कि जो anode है वो positive electrons और cathode है वो negative electrons. फिलामेंट्स के रूप में पाया जाता है यहाँ से इलेक्ट्रॉन्स एनोड पे टकराते हैं उसके बाद 99 परसेंट हीट जनरेट होती है वन परसेंट इलेक्ट्रॉन प्रोड्यूस होता है इलेक्ट्रॉन आर प्रोड्यूस बाय हीटी टंगस्टेन फिलामेंट एंड एसरेटेड अक्रॉस द ट्यूब टू हिट द टंगस्टेन टारगेट उसके बाद क्लास एनक्लोजर है क्लास एनक्लोजर की क्या जरूरत होती है इट इज नेसेसरी टू सील द टू इलेक्ट्रॉन ऑफ द एक्सरे ट्यूब इन द वैक्यूम मतलब जो एक्सरे ट्यूब में जो इलेक्ट्रॉन्स रहते हैं इलेक्ट्रॉड्स इलेक्ट्रॉड्स जो रहते हैं उसको वैक्यूम में रख रख के उसको सील रखता है जिसकी वजह से किसी भी टाइप की एयर या गैस मॉलिकूल नहीं चले जाए अगर गैस प्रेजेंट होती है एक्सरे ट्यूब में तो क्या होगा द इलेक्ट्रॉन्स दैट वर बींग एसोलेटेड टू द एनोड मतलब जो एनोड पर जो इलेक्ट्रॉन्स को टकराना था वो वहाँ नहीं टकरा के कोलिड विद द गैस मॉलिकूल्स गैस गैस मॉलिकल्स के साथ कॉलिड हो जाएंगे जिससे क्या होगा लॉस एनर्जी लॉस ऑफ एनर्जी होगा एंड कॉज सेकेंडरी और उसकी वजह से सेकेंडरी इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इजेक्टेड हो जाएंगे करेक्ट कहाँ से जिन गैस मॉलिकल से इलेक्ट्रॉन टकरा रहे हैं वहाँ से सेकेंडरी इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इजेक्टेड हो जाएंगे जिससे कि लॉस ऑफ एनर्जी और प्रॉपर एनर्जी के एक्सरेज नहीं प्रोड्यूस होंगे बाई दिस प्रोसेस दिस इज प्रोसेस आयोनाइजेशन एडिशनल इलेक्ट्रॉन्स वुड बी अवेलेबल फॉर एसोलेशन टू आर द एनोड ऑब्वियसली दिस प्रोडक्शन ऑफ सेकेंडरी इलेक्ट्रॉन वुड नॉट बी सेटिस्फैक्ट्री कंट्रोल देर प्रेजेंस वुड रिजल्ट इन वेरिएशन इन द नंबर ऑफ मोर स्ट्रिंगली इन द रिड्यूस स्पीड ऑफ द इलेक्ट्रॉन इन पिंचिंग ऑन द टारगेट करेक्ट इसके बाद फ्रेंड्स द गैस एक्सरे ट्यूब विच कंटेन ए स्मॉल अमाउंट ऑफ गैस टू सर्व ए सोर्स ऑफ सेकेंडरी इलेक्ट्रॉन द पर्पज ऑफ द वैक्यूम इन द एक्सरे ट्यूब इज टू अलाउ 
the number of speed and the acceleration accelerated electron to be controlled independently. The shape and size of the X-ray tube are especially designed to prevent electric discharge between the electrodes. Right? Next, the connecting wire must be sealed into glass wall of the X-ray tube. During operation of X-ray tube, both the glass and the connecting wire are heated to high temperature. Correct? Pyrex glass are generally used in X-ray tubes. Next, the topic is point of cathode. कैथोड क्या होता है फ्रेंड्स पहले ही बताया हुआ कैथोड जो होता है वो नेगेटिवली टर्मिनल इलेक्ट्रोड्स होता है फिलामेंट होता है द कैथोड इज द नेगेटिव टर्मिनल ऑफ द एक्स रे ट्यूब इज कॉल्ड द कैथोड इट इज इन रेफरिंग टू एन एक्स रे ट्यूब इन द टर्म कैथोड एंड फिलामेंट मे बी यूज इंटरचेंजेबली राइट अ स्टेटमेंट दैट इज नॉट ट्रू फॉर अदर टाइप ऑफ डायोड Tubes in the addition of filament, which is source of electron for the X-ray tube. There are the connecting wire which supply both the voltage average about 10 voltage and the amperage and average about 3 to 5 ampere. The heat of the filament and the metallic focusing cup. The number of X-ray produced depend entirely on the number of electrons that flow from the filament to the target. The X-ray tube current measure in milliampere. This is the very important question. कि जो tube current है वो milliampere में measure किया जाता है और one milliampere जिसको तो zero point zero zero one ampere. Now do the number of electron flowing per second from the filament to target. The filament is जो filament रहता है क्या तो अरे the made up made up of tungsten wire about zero point two mm in diameter. That is Coiled to form vertical spiral about 0.2 cm. 0.2 mm is diameter of that, and spiral uh, vertical spiral form is over that is 0.2 cm in diameter and 1 cm less in length of that. The process of thermionic emission, which may be defined as the emission of electrons resulting from the absorption of thermal energy, the electron clouds surrounding the filament produced by thermionic emission has been termed as addition effect. Correct? The electrons cloud surrounding the filament produced by thermionic emission has been termed as addition effect. A pure tungsten filament must be heated to temperature of at least 2200 degrees Celsius to emit useful number of electron thermions okay it is chosen for uh, use in excretive however because it can it can be drawn into a thin wire that is quite strong as high melting point 3370 degrees celsius and as little tendency to vaporize thus such as filament has reasonably long life expectancy Electrons emitted from the tungsten filament from the small cloud in the immediately vicinity of the filament. This collection of negatively charged electrons from what is called the space charge. This cloud negatively charged tend to prevent other electrons from being emitted from the filament until they have acquired sufficient thermal energy to overcome the force caused by the space charge. The tendency of a space charge to limit the emission of more electrons from the filament called the space charge effect. Next, the number of electrons involved in andromas, the unit of electric current is ampere, which may be defined as the rate of flow when one coulomb of electricity flow through a conductor is one second. The coulomb is the equivalent of the amount of electric charge carried by 6.25 to 10 to the power minus 18 electrons. Therefore, an accelerative current 100 ma may be considered as the flow of 6.25 to 10 to the power minus 17 electrons from the cathode to anode in one second. Electron current across an accelerative is one direction only always gathered to anyone. 
the focusing cup is designed so electrical force causes the electron stream of converse onto the target anode in the required size of set the focusing cup is usually made up of nickel this is the very important modern x-ray tube may be supplied with the single or more commonly a double filament line focus principle this is the most important topic uh, most important question is ke topic bolte hain the focal spot is the area of the tungsten target there is bombarded by the electron from the cathode most of energy of the electron is converted into heat with less than 1% being converted into x ray the melting point of tungsten is about 3 and uh, 3370 degrees celsius but it is best to keep the temperature below 3000 degrees celsius the problem posed by the needed for a large focal spot to allow greater heat loading and the conflicting need for a small focal area to produce good radiographic detail were resolved in uh, 1980 with the development of the line focus principle the size and shape of the focal spot are determined by the size and shape of the electron stream when it it hit on anode correct the anode angle differ, uh, differ according to the individual tube design may vary from 6 to 20 degree apparent focal spot is considerably smaller than that the actual focal spot the projected focal spot is directly related to the sign of the angle of the anode an anode angle of 16.5 degree will produce a smaller focal spot size than the angle of 20 degree thus uh, as the angle of the anode is made smaller the apparent focal spot also become smaller for general diagnostic radiography done at 40 inch focus for film distance uh the anode angle is usually usually no smaller than 15 degree focal spot size is expressed in term of apparent of projected focal spot size focal spot ka jo rehta hai 0.3 0.6 1.0 or 1.2 mm are commonly employed this is the complete uh, diagram of the x ray electrodes this is the apparent focal spot always smaller than the actual focal spot correct this is the line focus principle next uh, point here the anode anode is the positive electron of the x ray tube or two type of stationary or rotary stationary anode the anode of the stationary anode x ray tube consists of a small plate of tungsten 2 to 3 mm thick that is embedded in the large mass of copper the tungsten plate is square or rectangular in shape with each dimension usually being greater than 1 cm the anode angle is usually 15 to 20 degree as the discussed above correct the tungsten is chosen as the target material for the several region it has high atomic 74 which is make it more efficient for the production of x ray in addition because of its high melting point it is able to withstand the high temperature produced most metal melt between 300 and 1500 degrees celsius whereas tungsten melt at 3370 degrees celsius tungsten is a reasonably good material for the absorption of heat for the rapid dissipation of the heat away from the target area correct copper is better conductor of the heat than tungsten so the massive copper anode act increase the total thermal capacity of the anode the speed of the speed its rate of cooling correct this is also the lateral view of the cathode and anode stationary anode x ray tube uh, stationary anode this is the stationary anode correct rotatory anode the rotating the anode of the rotate, rotating anode tube consist of large disk of tungsten or an alloy of tungsten which theoretically rotates at the speed of about 3600 resolution per minute rpm 
when an exposure is being made. In, in practice, the error never reach as a speed of that is 600 RPM because of the mechanical. For mechanical factors such as slipping between the rotor and bearings, therefore the calculate the ability of a tube with stand high load uh, speed of 3000 RPM is usually. It's safe to assume that the anode rotation of the any functional rota rotating anode will never drop below 3000 RPM and will usually be greater than the 3000 RPM if 60 hazard current is used. The tungsten disc has bevel is the angle of the bevel may vary from 6 to 20 degree. The bevel is used to take advantage of the line focus principle previously described. The purpose, uh, the purpose of the rotating anode is the spread of the heat produced during an exposure over the large area of the anode. The anode 7 mm high and 2 mm wide, the area of the anode provided by electron represented by 40 mm square rectangle. This is the ro rotating anode disc, uh, the rotating anode increase the total target. Correct? And this is also the lateral view of the rotating anode and this is cathode, the major component of rotating anode exit tube. Lubricants uh, such as the oil would vaporize when the heat it destroy the vacuum in the tube. Dry lubricants such as graphite would wear off the powder and destroy the vacuum. This problem was solved by the metallic lubricant such as sil especially silver, which is the suitable for use in the high vacuum in a modern rotating axle tube. Molybdenum has high melting point 2600 degrees Celsius and is a, a poor heat conduct. Thus, the molybdenum step provide a partially heat barrier between the tungsten disc and the bearing of the anode assembly. It has been found that the alloy of about 90 degree, a 90 percent tungsten and 10 percent rhenium, a heavy metal with good thermal capacity. Uske baad friends jo hai, focusing cup, a third electrode nickel is used the grid control tube control the flow of electron from the filament to target. The third electrode is focusing cup that is surrounded the filament. It is, it is made up of nickel, right? Grid control X-ray tube contain its own switch which is allowed to X-ray tube to be turned on and off rapidly as required with cinephilographic, correct? This, fluoro, this focusing cup help to focus the electron on the target because each electron is negatively charged to electron repel on one another as they travel to the target. As a result, the electron beam spread out. Okay, thank you friends. Uh, the topic is next topic production of X-ray the second topic is heal effect tube breathing chart, process of generation X-ray, intensity of X-ray beam or gross jo summary rahega iska wo aur is pe jo most important question banenge wo next video mein dalunga to channel ko subscribe karna na bhule video ko share like comment share kare thank you friends